Hi guys, welcome to my channel. Today's video is episode 16 of my $25 thrift challenge. If you guys watched last week's episode, you already know exactly why I'm wearing this top. Basically, if you didn't watch last week's episode, Jason went last week and did the $25 thrift challenge and picked out an outfit for me. So if you wanna watch that video, I will link it down below. This top is the first thing that he picked out. And I've gotta admit, when I first saw it and like tried it on, I was like, I don't know about that. It's actually grown on me a lot. And what's so funny is I've been reading all y'all's comments and you guys seem to really enjoy this top and the jacket that he got me which is so funny because those were the two pieces that I was like I would have never picked those but now that I'm wearing this top I'm like a really big fan I don't know I think it's kind of happy and just something that I don't really have anyway if you guys are new to my channel basically every week I go to Goodwill and I spend $25 to put together an outfit or find some pieces that I really love and I started this whole series because I just wanted to prove that you don't need to spend a lot of money to stay on trend and to build your wardrobe so let's get into it there's me I think one of my biggest fears is filming this entire thing, picking everything out, and then realizing that I left my wallet at home. That has yet to happen, but I just checked to make sure I had my wallet because I was like, I have a feeling I would forget my wallet today, but I didn't, so we're good. Check out these men's Gucci shorts. I'm not a man, but these are incredible. How adorable is this little purse? I think this is just like the sweetest little thing ever. Also, I kind of like this. I don't know, is that weird that I like this? Somebody tied a knot in the top, which is actually something that like I would do, but I don't really like it with the knot. It feels so good to be back this week doing this. I can definitely already tell I always go over $25. And I really try not to, but when you find like really good stuff, I just can't. I can't say no. I think this dress is really cute, but I don't have the energy or the patience to try to get that off the mannequin. You guys, it's a little baby coach bag. How cute is that? It's so tiny though. I found this really cool necklace, which actually kind of looks like a Madewell necklace I just sold. Believe it or not, that was just in the little entrance. I haven't even started looking at bags or anything yet. So we're gonna start in shorts today and hopefully we just find a bunch of stuff. I'm honestly not even trying to stick to the 25 today because I took last week off, Jason did last week, so I'm ready to just spend all my money. <laughs> Found a pair of J. Crew little light denim shorts. I think these would be just really comfortable. Look how crazy this denim is. Are you kidding me? Jason asked me how I film while I'm thrifting and the answer is very slowly. So I found a couple tank tops that I'm really excited about. I thought this was just the cutest little lace print. And then a knitted tank, a white tank. But I think I might put this one back because I don't really know if that's all that exciting. bummed about because I was hoping that there would be some but now I'm gonna look through shoes and then I'm gonna go back and look through pants really bad luck and accessories there are no shoes either how adorable is this little hat oh my gosh cute can you tie it under you why not we're gonna go through jeans now I'm mentally prepared I'm ready to do it I hope we find something good
yet another disappointing. I can't find anything. No jeans. Well, one pair, but I don't know. It doesn't look very hopeful. Not doing too well today in the pants. I love stripes. We made up for the lack of jeans and skirts. And you guys are gonna freak out when you see the skirts that I got. Now it's time to try everything on and figure out what I wanna get. As you can see, this is everything I picked out. Lots of fun prints, some red. I am so excited about everything. I kind of want everything to work, but then I also kind of don't because if it all looks good, then I'm probably gonna buy it all. Yeah. But now I'm gonna try everything on and show you guys what I picked out when we get home. Little outfit of the day. This gives you a better idea of what the top looks like. I think it's actually really cute. I do have a new necklace, however, from Missouri on. And if you guys want free shipping, I have like a little affiliate link down below. And then look how cute this little pinky ring is. This is also by them and I love it. I thought this skirt was adorable because the little flowers on it, but it's missing two of the snaps and I'm so bummed about it because I just thought it was so cute. All right, remember when I told you it was the $25 thrift challenge? Well, we just upgraded to the $70 thrift challenge because I spent $71. I got three full bags of stuff. I got so many pieces. So you guys better just grab a snack, grab a drink because the next part, the try-on portion is gonna be a long one. <laughs> All right, so I just got home, and like I said in the car, I spent over $70, but I got so many good pieces. I got tons of skirts, dresses, floral prints that I'm just really excited about. I'm gonna try to do this really quickly. I'm not gonna talk too much about the pieces and just let them speak for themselves. A lot of these are really unique though. They are perfect summer pieces, and I hope you guys enjoy them. So I'm just gonna start with the only home thing that I got. It's this cute little wicker tray. Isn't this just the most adorable little thing you've ever seen? I thought it'd be so cute with like perfumes on it. I just think this would look so good on our dresser or our coffee table. The next thing that I got is this adorable little hat. This looks so bad with this top, so I'm gonna put this on with one of the other pieces, but it's just the most precious little hat I've ever seen, and you can like tie it. And the thing I love the most about it is that it has like all this little detailing in the weaving. Riley wants to say hi! Come on! Okay, so now we have a little special guest Riley wanted to join. All right, so now on to clothing, and I'm gonna start with the most basic thing that I got. This is just a little sweater tank. I've been really into sweater tanks lately. So this sweater tank is so basic and plain, but I really love it. I don't have a cream tank like this, so I thought this would be a really great throw-on piece, plus it looks really good with the other pieces that I got today. The next thing that I got is another sweater tank. Are you leaving? Okay, bye. And I just love the stripes on this. I thought it was very, like, 90s. Clearly, I have this thing with stripes. If you can't tell, I like stripes. I think they're fun. So I think this tank is perfect for summer. It's definitely basic, but it's a little bit more dressed up than a t-shirt, and I could definitely see myself just throwing this on to run errands. And then I think this is the last top, but this is a cute little cold shoulder top, and it's kind of silky. It has just really, really dainty pieces that kind of rest over your shoulder, which you guys will see when I try it on, because this just doesn't look that great. But on, it's really cute. So I think this top is so gorgeous. I love the material of this I think that the thin straps are just really elegant Obviously, I would wear a strapless bra with it But I love how the shoulder parts just kind of lay over really delicately All right now it's time for the fun part Those were all of like the really basic tops that I got that I just like to throw on But now it's time for the most exciting part and you guys I got so many skirts and we're just gonna we're just gonna jump into it right now All right, so the first skirt that I got is this gorgeous maxi red skirt something about this is like tropical and beachy and very like hawaiian and i'm okay with that a lot of these actually are very tropical looking but i don't have anything like this i think this is so fun and i thought this would look so cute with that white sweater tank or a t-shirt that's tied so i think this skirt is so fun it hits right at my feet i think it's just the most adorable little tropical skirt so this is a really fun piece for me i think it looks really great with the sweater tank that i have and then this is just an up close of the pattern again it's just like such a fun piece. It's so flowy. The next skirt that I got is another tropical skirt. And this one, I feel like you could literally buy on Zara right now. How adorable. 
adorable is this? It has these buttons down the front. It hits right below the knees. It's a great length. And it has like these little belt loops on the back if you want to put a little belt on with it. This is like my ultimate dream skirt. Like wear it with a pair of sneakers. Wear it with a t-shirt that's like knotted. I love this skirt so much. I love the length of it. I think it's so on trend right now. I mean, you could definitely find this at like Urban Outfitters. But now you can see kind of a close-up of the print. And I think it's just so cute. Okay, last skirt. Another floral print. I'm on a roll. How gorgeous is this? This is a little bit less like fun, but this is more like romantic. I might actually shorten it just a little bit because it does go to my ankles, but I think I might shorten it and make it kind of like a little bit below the knee like that last skirt. And then it's just like the most gorgeous little floral pattern ever. I'm absolutely obsessed with this skirt. I think it's just so feminine and beautiful and just very elegant. And then as you can see, I tied the little hat underneath, but you can just pop it up and then this is a little up close of the pattern i think it's just the most gorgeous pattern i love how thin and flowy the material is but i love this hat i think it's so adorable i love the fact that you can kind of like tie it under your neck and then if you wanted to you could kind of wear it around on your back so it's a very versatile hat but i think it's just the cutest little thing so basically within the first 15 minutes of being in the store i knew that i was going to go over budget i just i didn't even care normally i'd be like chloe try to stick to 25 this is the 25 dollar thrift challenge i gotta be totally honest this week I was like, let's just see what we can find and if it looks good, we're gonna buy it. So you guys, I bought all that stuff and I'm like only halfway done. So keep watching. I hope you have your snack by now. These jeans may be my favorite pair of jeans that I've ever thrifted ever. They are like the best mom jeans that I've ever found. They still have the tags on them. They are brand new. They have elastic in them so that they fit around your waist perfectly. I'm gonna cut the bottom so that they fray. I just love these so much. I would buy these at Madewell or Urban Outfitters like right now and they were $7.99. So I absolutely love these jeans. I think they're so cute and so on trend right now and I love the fact that they're wide leg. You could also roll them to give them a different feel but I think they're so fun and perfect. If you guys want to see how I cut my jeans and how I distress my jeans I will leave a link down below I have a whole video on it okay so I ended up getting one bag and I just got this because I thought it was kind of adorable but it's just this cute little woven bucket bag the inside is really nice it has pockets so not everything is in there just loose but there's a pocket for your wallet and your phone it's perfectly clean on the inside and I just thought this would be a great little bag to just throw on with a cute little summer dress okay on her dresses now and I got some really Really cute one that I am thrilled about. This first one is an H&M dress. I just absolutely loved this like deep red kind of like wine color and it would look so good belted. It's just the most gorgeous like maxi flowy sheer dress ever. So I love the fact that this is kind of like a high low dress and that there's just a lot of movement. The only thing is it definitely needs a belt so I'm gonna belt it but you can kind of get an idea as I try to hold everything in. I think the color is just a really flattering color and then this just kind of gives you a bit of a close-up of the pattern the next dress that I got is also really adorable and I just thought it was so comfortable like it's a cotton material and it hits right below the knees and it just is comfy and I could just see myself wearing this out all day and being a little bit more cozy than jeans it has these ruffles around the collar and then I just thought the print was just very sweet I think this dress is so flattering on I love the way that it fits it's just a really beautiful cut and then I've got on the cute little woven bag as well but I just think this would be a great little daytime outfit okay and if you've made it this far this is the last piece I've been wanting a dress this color for so long and it's the most adorable little forever 21 dress it looks so good with jewelry on and I just thought it was the sweetest little dress ever it's a large but it actually fits really nicely this is definitely one of my favorite pieces from today I absolutely love this dress so much but I love the neckline on it and I think the color is just so pretty and it's so summery and just happy looking I love the length of it I don't feel like it's too short to wear out and about but I just think it's a really great fun throw-on summer dress it's really really casual so you could wear it with sneakers or if you wanted to dress it up you could definitely wear it with some cute sandals or heels so that's everything for this week's episode i hope you guys enjoyed this video and this giant 
thrifting try on haul. If you've made it this far, thank you so much for sticking with it and watching. Be sure to give this video a big thumbs up if you liked it and leave me a comment down below letting me know which piece is your favorite. There's a lot to choose from this week, so I can't wait to read your comments and see which pieces you guys love. I go thrifting every week, so if you want to see more thrifting videos by me, make sure to hit that subscribe button. And don't forget to turn on notifications if you haven't already so you know when my videos go live. But I'll see you guys real soon. Bye! Hey.